This is a big, big tract. This is, uh, how big is this tract? It's looking like 34 acres. Uh, this was, was logged, this was heavily logged. Um, I don't know, about a year ago, I guess. Um, it wasn't clear cut, but it was certainly um, heavily logged. Some sections um, almost were clear cut. This is a, a wintertime drone video, so you're really not seeing very many leaves on the trees on the property, but um, it, it's, it's interesting because it's, it's a fantastic area for hunting. Um, the property lays really nicely. It's got access along a gravel road. It actually fronts a creek bed along two sides. It, it fronts a, a little seasonal wet weather creek along its uh, west side, and then it fronts a larger um, creek bed along its south side, although it's still probably a wet weather creek. Um, but we did see some, some pockets of water even on some dry days. So we're heading, uh, let me see if I have a map for this, get my bearings straight. We're heading um, westerly, basically. We're, we're actually over the south side of the property. Um, so it, it lays on this side of that road. Well, at this point, it's on both sides of the road, actually. You're going to want to check out your topo map or your aerial map to really see what's going on here. But um, now we're getting into an area with a little more timber on it. Um, just phenomenal property with, with a lot of uses. Uh, because it was recently logged, you're definitely not paying for a lot of timber on this one. Um, you could clean it up. I mean, we've cleaned up dozens of properties over the years that have, have been logged. But uh, honestly, if you're not in a big rush and you just wait a few years, Mother Nature will take care of 90% of this for you within just a few uh, short years. Um, but just phenomenal area. Uh, we've had properties out here before. We're very close to the Jacks Fork River. We're very, very close to the Rocky Creek Conservation Area. Uh, this is an extremely popular area for deer hunting and turkey hunting. So now we're looking, um, I guess, back east over the property. Um, yeah, uh, I, rarely can we sell a, a property of this size for, for such a low price. So we're actually uh, pretty pumped to be able to get this one out and, and you know, maybe you didn't think you could afford a property quite this size. Well, here's an opportunity to, to go ahead and snag one. Um, so there on the west side, you've actually got some, some timber left. And again, uh, since this video was taken the, the very first winter after it was logged, uh, it's going to look its worst um, in the springtime. A lot of these uh, little stick looking trees are actually going to leaf out and everything's going to look different. And, Make no mistake, it, it you know will still look logged for a couple years, but uh, you do get to see it at its worst in this video, which can be pretty cool. So definitely check out the topo map because you'll see that there are several areas. Um, I mean, it, it's it's typical Ozark land in that it's got some ups and downs, but it's got a beautiful ridge in the middle that kind of runs to the west. Could potentially be a just an outstanding uh, building site with some nice views. Um, we found some trails. We didn't explore too much, but we found some trails on the property, some good trails that could be opened up pretty easily um, if you wanted a nice private driveway. Um, Off-grid property, no one's going to bug you out here, um, but you're still not too far out of Eminence, Missouri, uh, Mountain View, Missouri to the south. Uh, there's the truck on the road, land on the left. Whoop, there we go. Uh, check us out at instantacres.com. Uh, it's it's a little unusual that we get a bigger piece like this. We definitely do, but it's becoming harder and harder to get the, the big pieces of land. Um, so here's a good chance to grab one. Instantacres.com is where you will find this property if it's still available. Otherwise, uh, send us an email at sales at instantacres.com and we'll see what we can find for you.